As soon as Mourinho was made Manchester United manager, people questioned how long he was going to be at the club. It's certainly going to be longer than his first three-year contract because Mourinho has now extended his contract at Manchester United until at least 2020 with the option to extend one more year. And for me, it is absolutely the right decision. We have gone from Louis van Gaal, Paddy McNair and Tyler Blackett to Champions League knockout football, Alexis Sanchez in January, with Paul Pogba in midfield alongside Nemanja Matic. Manchester United under Jose Mourinho have come on leaps and bounds. We've still got a lot to do, but keeping him at the club was absolutely the right thing to do. There really are so many reasons to be positive about Mourinho's first couple of years in charge. Look at his first season. Won two trophies, he'll call it three, but it's two, the Europa League and the League Cup. No manager in United's history has won silverware in his first season. Mourinho did. We went 40 games unbeaten at Old Trafford between the two derby losses. Yes, we got to perform better in those big games, but 40 games unbeaten at home. A record equaling run matched by Samat Busby's team back in the 60s. United building a fortress again at Old Trafford thanks to Jose Mourinho. We're back in the Champions League after winning the Europa League last year. He completed the set. United have now won every trophy we could possibly have won as a club after winning the Europa League last year. And now we're back in the Champions League knockout. Can we beat Sevilla and reach the quarterfinals? Fans are certainly hoping so. And if you're looking at Mourinho's signings, great signings. Paul Pogba, Nemanja Matic, Zlatan Ibrahimovic, Romelu Lukaku, Eric Bailly, Yes, Viktor Lindelof hasn't worked out yet, but I've still got the belief that he will. And look at the players he's sold as well. Memphis Depay, Morgan Schneidlin. But most importantly, out of all the players that have left, it was the ability for Mourinho to correctly manage Wayne Rooney and his transition out of Manchester United. He left at the right time. And Rooney leaving the club was a huge, crucial point for me, anyway, in United properly moving forward after Fergie. With Rooney out of the picture, it's allowed Rashford to shine, Martial to shine, Lukaku to take centre stage. This is a new look United team and we've just signed Alexis Sanchez in January. What a January transfer that is. Picking Arsenal's best player, dropping him into this team. And as I said, I, I think it's been a fantastic couple of years from Mourinho. But if Mourinho doesn't win the Champions League or the Premier League by the end of next season, he's effectively failed in his first three years as Manchester United manager because that is his main priority. He's been brought in to win the Premier League and the Champions League. The League Cup, the FA Cup, the Europa League, all fantastic trophies, but that's not what Mourinho wants. And the fact that he has signed this deal shows he is confident that he can get this United team to win the Premier League and win the Champions League in his time at the club. That is his priority. And if he can do that in the second phase, his second contract at United, then it's going to be a hell of a ride in the next couple of years. But I just want to say thank you to Mourinho in helping United find that winning mentality again. That disappeared, that completely disappeared under Van Gaal and Moyes. We lost that fear factor. That's come back at Old Trafford. We've got the winning mentality. Yes, we need to improve our performances in the derby against Liverpool, in against Arsenal. We won at Arsenal away. That was the sort of performance we need to see more of in the big games. But that's coming. From where we've come from to where we are now, Mourinho has massively improved United. And going forward, I'm looking forward to seeing what is next. Hopefully, a Premier League or a Champions League in the next couple of years. That's what Mourinho has signed an extension to do. Let's see if he can do it. But are you happy with Mourinho signing a new deal? Let me know in the comments below. Do you think he is the right manager to take United forward properly in the next few years? Again, let me know in the comments. As always, drop a like on the video and subscribe to United People's TV. We'll see you soon.